We are still here at Electronica 2024 in Munich and we stopped by at the Giga Device stand because the, one of the Giga Device evaluation boards has won a Best in Show award. Now, at Electromaker we cover a wide variety of different development boards and kits and uh, Giga Device is someone that we haven't really come across in terms of these kind of evaluation boards before, but there's no surprise there. A lot of the stuff we cover is a lot closer to the maker end of the spectrum. But this one is really quite special. It combines a lot into one frame using the GD32 range of microcontrollers and it really is a range. There are ARM Cortex microcontrollers, some of them have RISC V cores, but I've been joined by Ruben who's going to take us through the uh, GDXD, which I believe stands for multidimensional, is it that correct? Indeed, uh, correct? Yeah, the evaluation board and what makes it special and why they think it may have won the Best in Prize award. So um, what is the evaluation board? Let's just start from there. What does it combine? This is a, a, a new design, a new concept uh, we've done. Yeah. And as you can see before I talk more about it, is yeah. we have lots and lots of different evaluation boards. Absolutely, yeah. And these evaluation boards are really to evaluate or to demonstrate a particular product. Mm -hmm. Now at Giga Device, we have uh, four business units. Yes. We're not just about MCUs. Mm -hmm. We offer other products such as uh, battery chargers, power products, fingerprint sensors and uh, flash memories. So what we've done here, and this one makes this board unique for ourselves, is that it's a board that actually demonstrates a product from each of these business units. Absolutely, yeah. So we can see here on this board here, for the main processor or the controller, we are using the W515. Uh, this is a uh, Cortex M33 with a truss zone support, but also has the 2.4 gig transceivers, okay. uh, which supports uh, Wi-Fi, mm -hmm. so we can do Wi-Fi connectivity mm -hmm. on that particular microcontroller. Then we also use some uh, flash memories, so we're using some NOR flash. Yes. Uh, this could be used for storing the stack, it could be used for the application, the data, mm -hmm. but it's there to be used. Yes. And then the other two products we have here is obviously the fingerprint sensor. Mm -hmm. So this is doing the uh, biometric scanning, fingerprint scanning. We use the processor to do the processing and running the algorithms. Mm -hmm. And then we also have the power products, yeah. not just the LDO, mm -hmm. but also the battery management, yes. where we can see the battery here, mm -hmm. where the whole unit can be powered off the battery. So this board demonstrates a different products from our, all our different business units and it allows the end user to evaluate these different uh, products uh, built and designed all together. Absolutely, yeah. And so that alone is obviously a, a very useful thing for the end user. It's also fantastic from your perspective, being able to show all of these things working together. Yes. Um, so if someone was to try and get their hands on one of these evaluation boards now, the other side of it, of course, is software support. Yes. So um, if someone did get a hold of, say, this exactly exact evaluation board, I mean, I'm seeing there's a demo running on it right now. Yes. So presumably there are some reference code. Uh, there is some uh, reference code there that people could start to incorporate into their own designs and decide what they wanted to do with this particular setup. Yes. So um, what is there available for on the programming side for people who want to get started with this? So at the moment now, uh, this is a non-sellable product. Yeah. Uh, we just use this more for uh, demonstrations mm -hmm. and for customers to evaluate. Mm -hmm. So we tend to work on a one-to-one -one basis. Yeah. So customers interested, we can talk, we can provide the board. Mm -hmm. And then for the uh, software side of things, we can provide the software, uh, such as uh, running this particular example. Mm -hmm. And then uh, some customers may like to use it as a reference design. Yeah. So we can provide you with the uh, schematics and the uh, deliverables, the documentation uh, to design and use such a board. Absolutely, yeah. And I suppose the final question would be just um, if someone wanted to get a hold of one of these evaluation boards and maybe approach you to see about all of these things, uh, what's the best place for them to find this? We can go on to our uh, corporate website, mm -hmm. which is uh, gigadvice.com, mm -hmm. or you may already have your own channels, your uh, distribution or representatives, mm -hmm. and please feel free to uh, contact them. Absolutely, and as always, uh, the links to everything that we've talked about here will be underneath this video. You can find a link out to the evaluation board, um, and you can find out all of the reasons why it won one of the best in show awards here at Electronica. Ruben, thank you so much for your time. Thank you very much.